Hey guys, I'm Andre and today I bring you Gatsby and how to generate a robots.txt file. The robots.txt file is an essential part of your website for all search engine robots that visit your site. You can tell them which URLs to uh, index or which URLs to omit. For example, search results pages are not something you want to be indexed in Google. The same applies to secure pages, to personalized pages. One example that comes to mind from my experience is when I built my wedding site that was uh, personalized. I don't want Google to index that because every invitee gets their own URL. So even if Google somehow reached those URLs, I don't want that to be included in the search results. So how can we add the robots.txt file into Gatsby site? Well, first of all, we can go and look for Gatsby robots.txt plugin. And we will reach the Gatsby plugin robots.txt page in the Gatsby's documentation. So just like with uh, any other plugin, I'm just gonna install that into my site. Now make sure that you're installing the plugins into an offline site. So if your site is running, you might get into some issues. Once the plugin is installed, now we can take a look at how to adjust the Gatsby config. You see, it's just as simple as adding the plugin definition. And let's take a look at some of the options here that are essential for most sites. So apart from resolving the plugin, we need to specify the host, the sitemap, and the policy for your website. So I'm just gonna copy and paste this. So this would be the very simple policy for my blog. If you don't have sitemap generated yet, make sure to check this video where I tell you how to do it using Gatsby. In order to see the generated robots.txt file, we have to build the site. And once the site is built, we can take a look at the public folder where we should see the robots.txt file generated. And if we take a look at its contents, it's the sitemap, the host as I defined it in the plugin definition, and it tells Google to index the whole site. So how do we adjust the robots.txt file to make sure it does not index any search results pages? We simply go back to the Gatsby config.js and here in the policy we add additional attribute here, disallow, and say it disallow slash search. Now I'm gonna build the site again. So here we go, the file was modified and you see that now there is disallow slash search so Google won't index any search results. Of course, there are uh, many more ways how you can adjust the robots.txt file. If you're interested in uh, the advanced adjustments, take a look at this page in the Gatsby documentation. The link to this page is down in the video description. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel using the link over there. And also follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash underbus to make sure you won't miss any of the new videos. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.